You want to have a rematch right now? Let's make some noise. Who's going <laughs> to declare for dead orbit next time? Future war call. Yeah. Inspired, dude. I don't know if you're going to watch this video right now, but you really just need to elevate the aesthetic of your characters. Brown and white has never been a successful color scheme, and it's not going to be anytime soon. Okay, just abandon it. So cute. <laughs> Bye -bye. All right guys, welcome to the video today. I've been thinking all day trying to come up with a video idea because for some reason like there is just nothing to make videos about for this game all of a sudden. For tip videos, like I don't really think this game is that hard to get good at because there's not really much of a skill gap so I can't do that. And then for weapon reviews, none of them are amazing so that like there's no standout weapons really. But like 20 minutes ago, I was sitting on the toilet waiting to take a shower, taking a fat uh, sip from my water cup and I you know, I just, it just came to me, okay? I remembered the hand cannon that I started playing this game with, the minuet, and it, it is amazing. All right, so this is the gun. As you can see, my hunter is looking a thousand times fresher than Inspire's Poverty Titan. Uh, so if we're taking a quick look at it, um, it, it doesn't really stand out to you too much, right? You're like, it's a green weapon, so you can't even put a shader on it. So you, it's stuck looking like this. It has one perk, which is ricochet rounds, which increases stability and slightly increases range. Uh, and then it has steady hand. So steady hand is the best sight, in my opinion. Um, it seems for some reason the registration is the best on it. And then obviously having a little bit of range and stability helps as well. Like, I don't I there's no reason for this to be the best one um, but whenever I, I like the, the one time that I streamed destiny 2 and I was using this everyone was wondering what I used uh, because everything was connecting for some reason so as I mentioned earlier most weapons in destiny aren't going to completely revolutionize the way you play and just using this hand cannon over another one isn't going to completely revolutionize your life and just make everything easier however I kind of found it funny how a green hand cannon is somehow my favorite one and performs the best it is kind of weird like weapons in destiny 2 the, like they took away a lot of the essential perks that make weapons really really good for example in destiny 1 if you're looking for a hand cannon you automatically knew if it didn't have send it from year one so during the year year one era you needed send it or hammer forged during year two slash year three it needed a rifled barrel and if they didn't have that then you knew for the most part that they wouldn't be that good but with destiny 2 they kind of got rid of those perks so even weapons that are whites or greens can still be really good in fact my first Destiny 2 sweat I played against not just like random people it was against really good players from Destiny 1 and I ended up going in with a pariah which is the very first auto rifle you get the white auto rifle in this weapon and I was doing pretty much the best on my team every game so it kind of proves that um, weapons aren't that important in Destiny 2 and if you're leveling up a character and you're like oh you know I don't have an origin story or I don't have the dire promise or whatever your favorite hand cannon um, this is a very good option if, like in Destiny 1 it was kind of hard when you're leveling leveling up a character because you didn't have too many great options and you weren't going to be able to outgun a thorn with some garbage green hand cannon um, but this one is is actually good the weapon has good handling good range nine in the magazine it's just an overall solid weapon I'm not going to continue babbling on and repeat everything for 10 minutes because there's no point in doing that um, it's a good weapon I'll be rolling gameplay of it for the remainder of this video um, but I very quickly wanted to touch on a few things because moving forward with the future I'm not quite sure what the future holds for me and Destiny 2, like the game has been out for only a month and I really, ha I'm not hooked to it anymore. And I feel like, you know, usually when I go on the Bungie forums, uh, the, the only thing I see are idiotic posts. Like I, I saw one about this guy um, that thought Last Hope should be moved to the power ammo slot. Um, but I wasn't seeing many of those. And pretty much every post I saw was just people disappointed with Destiny 2 PvP. Hopefully Bungie will get their stuff together and give us what we want so that there's more incentive to, incentive to actually play the game. But they're definitely not going to get there by reskinning the better devils like four times. And if you're wondering why I made a video on this weapon now instead of like a month ago when I first found it, at the time I figured there's more important stuff like people wouldn't really care about greens too much. I wanted to focus on making videos on legendaries. But I figured with PC being released, you know, being as it is that I've done a lot of weapon reviews already, I know that people are going to be getting into the game that are new and want new weapons or, or basically low level weapons to use in PvP. And this one is probably your best choice for a hand cannon. So what I'm trying to say is if there are any other games that you're interested in watching me play like Fortnite, Overwatch, or you know pretty much anything, just leave a comment down below uh, saying what game you want me to play. So if you want me to play 
Destiny 2, put Destiny 2. If you want me to go back on Destiny 1 for some videos from time to time, you can put that as well. I've been playing a lot of Fortnite, so I got a 21 kill solo squad win that I uploaded to my second channel as a stream highlight. Um, so I'm interested in getting involved in different things and expanding. Um, I just want to hear your opinion on it. So that's pretty much it for the video. Like I said, I just kind of rolled gameplay throughout the video. There's not too much to talk about. You know, if you're low level and you want a good weapon that's a hand cannon, go ahead and use it. You can still use it if you're high level. I've been using it a ton and, and it's my favorite so far. Um, and you know, that's basically it. So hopefully you enjoyed it. And um, if you are subscribed and you don't want to miss a video, YouTube doesn't always send notifications and push the videos to your sub box. So if you go to my channel and you're subscribed, if you click on the bell and enable post notifications, it will make sure that you do not miss a video in your sub box. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it and I'm sorry for rambling. I'll see you next time. PC release in one day. The energy levels are high.